Visor X, Vision, Image, Strategy, Empowerment and Rejuvenation, was a theme at the Executive Coaching Workshop, which covered the full range of conventions, rules, customs and expectations that professionals and individuals must master in order to interact professionally with people in high-level business while working at the peak. Certified Life Coaches Janet Adetu and Jibodi as well as the Catalyst Life Coach Lanre Olushola and former Managing Director of Guinness Shenia Adetu shared practical life strategies to find maximum fulfillment. Lanre Olushola spoke on the need for vision. Do you have a long-term vision? Do you have that broken down into goals and targets that can be measured? Because that which is not measured never gets done to the fullest. And that which time is not allocated to it, right, is not appointed. So once you have done this exercise of uh, aligning your vision with your values and your core beliefs, you now ask yourself, what are the things in this area? What are the things I need to stop? What are the things I need to start? What are the things I need to do more of? and do less of. Once you have created those things, then you will now create what's the first step, what's the second step, and what's the fifth and sixth step. Yes. Never set a vision that is not in your control. Never. Because you are setting goals that someone else is driving. Can you influence them? Can you control them? No. You only have power over what you have power over. That's why that element of ownership and personal responsibility is key. Never ever set a vision for somebody else or that is driven by somebody else. The most important thing that you can do if it has to do with other people is you have to sit down with them and together you set that vision. But you must allocate your own role. What a leader has the ability to do is to influence and coordinate the activities of the smartest, the hunters, the largest, and the fastest, based on his influence and his presence. So I want to tell you in this room, and I want to submit to you, that the research that was stated, that was made by the Carnegie Institute, that said that, only 15% of corporate success is based on technical skills. The other 85 are from all the other levels of intelligences. People intelligence, social intelligence, emotional intelligence, body intelligence, everything else but what we call the quotient of IQ. So IQ is only 15%. Meanwhile, Shenny Adetu spoke on the need to strategize to win. Focus on the things that you can change, okay, and leverage that. Measure yourself against the best. Don't be what I call TAM. You know what TAM is? You know what TAM is? The tallest amongst midgets. Write your strategy, whether it's for your personal life, I keep talking about it, it's not just for corporate. Don't, don't cut yourself short. Don't try to be the tallest amongst midgets. Think big. The convener of the session, Janice Adetu, spoke on the need for continuous personal training for all. The best people in the world are people that have actually gone out of the way to develop themselves without being coerced into it. If you're in the workspace and you wait for your organization to send you on trainings, you're not going to get anywhere. You need to continuously develop yourself. The good thing about technology, again, is that you don't have to go to a physical school. You can do a lot of things online. You can do a lot of certifications online. All these things matter. When you power them up, it makes you a better person, a more productive person, and you're giving yourself more credibility when it comes to promotion. A lot of people might not even know that you're doing these courses. But by the time you keep submitting your additional certifications, it just takes you to greater heights. And you'd be surprised at what you have achieved. And these little, little things are the things that make the big difference. So development definitely is key. And that's what we're all about here today. You know, taking yourself from the level where you are now to a greater height, but intentionally. For Plus TV Africa, 
Irene Ubani.